So a nervous Shrek waited to meet Fiona's parents, King Harold and Queen Lillian. Hoping to impress them, Shrek even remembered to trim his nose hairs. After that minor stumble, the king and queen got along famously with Shrek, welcoming him with the tolerance, love, and affection usually reserved for pop stars and heads of state, or not. King Harold made it clear he wanted Fiona to marry Prince Charming and wasn't so fond of his fat, disgusting, nose-picking son-in-law. Shrek made it clear he loved Fiona and no pompous king was going to blatantly mock his ogre girth. Fiona and Queen Lillian were eventually able to break up the fight. The king was approached by Fairy Godmother, who was a powerful provider of happily ever afters, and a lot of people owed her favors. She makes offers you can't refuse and can make people disappear, literally. You understand where I'm going with this, right? Because she could leave me sleeping with the fishes if I said too much, and mirrors and fish don't mix. <laughs> Trust me. In the morning, tempers appeared to have cooled, and King Harold offered to show our group around far, far away. Welcome to Far, Far Away. Fabulous shopping, great view, beautiful people. Why don't you make yourselves useful and be my deputies? Deputy Shrek, at your service. Where you see this symbol, I need your help. There's been a foul catastrophe. The Friar's Fat Boy truck has overturned. We need to round up the chickens. Come on, they're even more cowardly than you. How brave of you to accept this grave chicken challenge.
A giant troll is after the family jewels. Can you collect the jewels before the nasty troll gets away? You should have no problem. I understand trolls and ogres are distant cousins. delinquent hooligans fighting in the streets like filthy ogres. I mean, beasts! Go arrest them now and throw them in the paddy wagon! Excellent! You take orders well! Hero time! on an ogre's bad side. Huh. 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 
Guess you need to learn the hard way. Huh. You're very soft. You got hurt by a measly peasant. If it ain't broke, break it! Does it hurt? You want fries with your knuckle sandwich? Not in my house. Take that! than you we kicked butt <laughs> 